What's good ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another episode of my Tank Request series. My dude Kalios has asked me to take out the SU-100, giving me the freedom of choice when it comes to gun selection. Well, he said he said Top Gun, but I there's two guns that can be viewed as the Top Gun on this thing, in my opinion. Either the 100mm or the 122mm, and my preference is has and I think probably will always be the 122 millimeter because we are in a tier 6 game quite a heavy tier 6 game actually um, sorry I mean like heavy top tier game here on Tundra and it is so 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 funny hitting people for you know like 460 damage when you get a high roll in this thing two shot in tanks of your own tier is yeah it's fun guys so highly recommend the 122 millimeter for fun and you never have trouble penetrating anything it's so easy 175 millimeters of penetration at this tier with 390 average damage yeah I, I one shot well you one you one shot M3 Lee's which is glorious so you know you can't you can't complain about one shot in M3 Lee's in my opinion Tundra man I've, I've not had any sort of decent TD map today like none. I I can't catch a break. I can't catch a break. Am I gonna I'm gonna push on this night, why not? Hello, do you want three hundred and ninety damage, comrade? Yes you do. Took a hit in return from something, but I don't care. I should be able to Oh man. I had shots, but I was I wasn't aimed whatsoever, and not aiming in this tank is bad, like really bad. So I wasn't going to do that right there. The knight is still there though. He's mad at me for smacking him for some big, big numbers. Kind of need to chill for a sec. Seeing if these lot are going to push up. Well, we're winning 3 0 so far. What is that? It's a Churchill 1. We've got a high concentration of tanks over here. Let me back up a little, get into a better spot. For when those guys eventually push around the corner, which they undoubtedly will. The knight has now gone away. These guys are definitely going to be pushing up soon, giving me some cushy side shots. Hopefully. Let me get in this bush. Ooh. Oh, keep coming, Achilles. No, I can't hit him anyway. Never mind. Can hit that chaffy though if my gun depresses a little. Damn, missed the chance. Missed the chance, but he didn't spot me, which is a plus. Yeah, can't hit that Achilles. I just I'm waiting for these guys to push up into this little valley ahead of me. Although if the chaffy keeps coming. Come on, back up a little more. Just a little more. This has been the story of the day for me, guys. Like just not being in the right position. But I'm a poor T D player, so I don't care. I just need map. I need awareness as to where to take TDs on maps. I don't think this is a very good T D map anyway. That is the thinnest of shots and I don't want to try it. I'll try that though. There we go. Got spotted when firing because that Churchill 1 is right there. Artillery will undoubtedly be shooting at me any second now. And now is when they come around the corner. So can I hit this guy? Can but can't. <laughs> I had a shot on him. But that doesn't mean it's going to land. Let's try and hit this Churchill 7. That is nice right there. 419... Good hit of damage. We've got a KV-1 pushing forward. 
Let's go for this guy. Derp. 396. This thing hits so hard. It's so fun to play. Is that KV-85. 389. Ooh, it's all kicking off now. Alright, chill, chill, chill. Churchill is down. We need the Churchill 7 to die as well. He's going to crest here. Three hundred and eighty two. He's probably gonna hit me. But he missed. Let's go for this. And we get the finishing shot on him. Trying to move just so artillery doesn't finish me off. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, get behind some cover. Alright, cool. That's when it hits me anyway, although nah, he's got problems of his own. We can push up on these boys now. Seven hits of damage, not too shabby. Could have done better though. There's not really a lot of health left remaining. in the KV-1 derps, the KV-85. No idea where their medium is. But this thing is... Oh, there's the medium. Okay. Oh, he's legging it anyway. Oh, he's just behind the rock. Nice, he's down. Oh, man. Damn. Well, time to just YOLO around and one shot him. <laughs> you are doomed. <laughs> uh, it's fair. Eight hits, three kills. And a nice bunch of damage done, hopefully. 2,500 damage. I'll take that for the first game of the day. High caliber medal. Not really a spectacular game, but it's tier 6. So doing doing 2.5 damage at tier 6 is, is okay, I would say. And we will move on to the next one. So I will see you there. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the second game. We are here on airfield and it is a tier seven game. So we've got some opportunity to do a bit more damage than the last one. And hopefully we will do. Hopefully we will. But I'm going to deploy. Let's deploy over here. Let's deploy over on this side. Hopefully get some. Oh, in fact, no, 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 no. I'm going the wrong way. Haha. <laughs> Ignore me. I'm going the wrong way, doing the wrong thing. Let's go over this side. This side's where we need to go. But yeah, taking out the SU-100 once again with the 122mm setup. So, more or less. Well, it is an SU-122. But this is the package that I enjoy taking out with this tank. Despite the accuracy of this gun being very troll at times. You just need to make sure that you fully aim every shot. And then everything will go relatively where you want it to. Obviously it's not guaranteed because it is Russian and Russian guns are very troll. But um, yeah, most of the time. I would say most of the time if you fully aim, it's going to behave how you want it to. But the... The 100mm is of course an option, and it's a good option. Uh, I do like using the 100mm as well, but I just prefer the 122. It's more fun. It's more fun. Smacking people in your own tier for 400, smacking tier 6s, tier 7s, tier 8s for 400 is fun. One hitting tier 4s and some tier 5s is also fun. So, it's just, yeah, it's one of those tanks, man. It's one of those... One of those derpy fun tanks that you can smash people with. Reverse driving skills are on point today. Please keep pushing around this corner, plebs. I would like to smack all of you. Just like that. 373 on that Churchill 7. I think that A43 realises. Does he realise where I am? Or is he just waiting to get smacked? 400 on the IS. Good hit right there. 
That A43 is just not moving, so I'm gonna go for him next. Let's have some fun. Wow, look how high. Look how high that went. See what I mean? The accuracy, even though you fully aim, can be unbelievably troll at times. But those, those were some nice hits right there. Nothing going on on that side. In fact, we're actually pushing... We're actually pushing up, aren't we? I don't think they're doing anything really. Look how, I mean, look how sandy my tank is. I'm sitting still. That A43, is he running? Oh shit. Okay, never mind. We will go down here. We will push up and be more aggressive. Wow, I mean, if that hit, it would have been hilarious, but it was never going to happen. Shit. I should have stayed back there. Because, look at this now. I, yeah, I should have stayed back there. That is really, really annoying. Just when you think you're doing the right thing, their team moves and does the complete opposite to what you thought they were going to do. That is really, really, really annoying. And I'd like to hit the IS. But we will and we'll bounce. And then, no doubt, artillery will smash us here. Let's make sure this A4... Wow, the A43 just got wrecked anyway. He is down. There is an SU-12244 over here and an E-25. Hello. Dude is going to rush me. Good stuff, man. <laughs> okay, bro. Rip you. Rip you. Now, the SU-12244 is over to my left. Shit. Move Hellcat. Never mind, artillery did its business. Thank you very much. Oh, now this guy has a better camo than me, and I think he I think he was over there. Or is he over there? Don't know where he is, but he's over there somewhere because he can spot me, so. This ain't good. Maybe I should move to a different position. What TD is tearing R87 apart? There he is. See, I knew he was over there. Just couldn't get a hit on him. Can we get him now? Look at that camo, boys. <laughs> 400 meters away and he's invisible behind no bushes. Good stuff. Jay Panther should be spotting him soon. There we go. That's a nice hit right there. Oh, that one missed. And now he's going to get away with it. No, he's not. No, he's not. Alright, so they've got a heavy tank and a Hummel. What is the heavy? Heavy's a TOG 2. Please, 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 please be on full health. Alright. Now, he's going to tear our AT7 apart. Yep, 
Yeah, but look how much health he has. I... Where is he gonna go? Where is that Tog gonna go? I need to stay in a position... Well, never mind, the Hellcat's gonna rip that artillery with any luck. Yeah, good stuff. Alright, let's be more aggressive on this guy now then. Let's be more aggressive. Because that's going to force him to come back to the cap. And I think he will be right here when I come around the corner, which he is. Yeah, nice shot on him right there. Artillery hits him. He is looking at me. But, you know, he can pin me once. But I will finish him off just like that. Ho 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 ho! That was nice. Wasn't as good as I thought it was going to be. But, good nonetheless. Let's see how much we did. 2,500 damage once again. Only a second class mastery. I'm not a good TD player, guys. I must apologize, but I'm happy with that, considering what happened. So, you guys know the drill in the comments section of this video. Please do let me know what tank you want me to take out next. If somebody else has already asked for that tank to be played go ahead and like their comment because the most liked comment will be the tank that i play next for next week's episode thank you so much for getting involved and putting your suggestions across and voting for the suggestions that you like i will see you guys in the next episode hope you did enjoy as always and until next time peace out